in popular culture, Jurassic Park mainly, we imagine the dinosaurs make a specific terrifying roar sound. Uh, but some scientists have found that it may be closer to... Whoa! Whoa! Science! Yeah, that was climactic. There you go. <laughs> You hold this. Okay. Um, so, uh, 65 million years ago, we imagined dinosaurs being these, you know, terrifying beasts of the world, and they were, but they yeah. are closely related to many avian species of today, which is how we're learning a lot about their physiology, you know, learning that they're, they may have actually had feathers, and they're, they're not quite, you know, <laughs> we, we learn these, like, bird-like qualities about dinosaurs, like feathers and perhaps not making a loud roar sound. Um, that makes them a little bit more less, of a gentle. Ah, oh, they're coming! A Ooh. giant bird! Ooh. Um, Ooh. Oh, we're all gonna die! <laughs> I, just, I can't get into it. Just, I'm not feeling it. I'm not feeling it's it. the coups of death. The coups of death. <laughs> Uh, researchers at the University of Texas did do a pretty comprehensive review of the vocal organs of birds and the kinds of sounds that they made. Um, and they matched these up to vocal organs found in fossils, fossilized dinosaurs, uh, for a paper coming out next month in the journal Evolution. And they found that the dinosaurs were far more likely to vocalize with a closed mouth. Uh, I should not have opened his mouth then. Uh, perhaps a, a sound like hmm or hmm. Or <laughs> he was like a car alarm. Uh, um, yeah, more of like a cooing sound, I think it would amount to okay. at the end, is what they came up to, not what I think. Uh, and <laughs> look, we're not talking about my findings. We're talking about researchers from university. Um, so that's a really interesting yeah. thing to think about, which is that it would be more like not a terrifying roar, but it can be pretty intimidating. And I have this video of an ostrich uh, to help you visualize this or think of how it would be. Oh. What is it doing? It must be mm -hmm. mm -hmm. I've never seen it do that. <laughs> mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So that's a little intimidating, right? And imagine that, but like ah. ten times the height. Oh. We sound like Skeksis we from sound, Dark Crystal. We sound like imbeciles, mm, basically. <laughs> well, we're mammals, so, you know, different. We're, we're not reptilian or avian. Avian species. Um, I mean, if Jurassic World or whatever yes. is coming out next did something closer to this and put the feathers all over the dinos, Maybe it wouldn't be as intimidating. Luckily, they, explain, the feathers, they yeah. explained it away with like the genetic uh, manipulation. Right. They created it in their own. Oh, we image. made this the way we yeah. we changed it. We did the we other genetics in the DNA, Mr. DNA, as some people call him. Um, audience, would you be scared of a cooing dinosaur? Are you more cool with uh, the depiction that we do have? Let us know below in the comments. And <laughs> please like and subscribe for more. <laughs>